はいこんにちは現在南アフリカのケープタウンで生活しています大阪府出身谷です<笑>はい、えー、今日は私が南アフリカで1年間生活してみて、えー、なんだこの言葉はと思った南アフリカのスラングを紹介していきたいと思いますそのスラングを説明してくれるのが、ここにいる南アフリカ人のロビンです。皆さん、こんにちは、ロビンです。ごめんなさい、私は日本語が話せません。<笑>大丈夫です。大丈夫です。ありがとう。<笑><笑>こんな感じで南アフリカの動画を他にも上げているので、えー、よければチャンネル登録と、えー、グッドボタン、あとベルボタンもよろしくお願いします。はい、えー、それじゃあ1つ目のスラングからいってみましょう第1つ目はロボットはいこの言葉初めて聞いた時に何かなと思ったんですけどね何だと思いますか皆さん考えてみてくださいどうぞブリーン<笑><笑>はい、正解は。ロボット。イエス、イエス。トラフィックライト。ディンディンディンディンディンディンディンディンディン。I don't really say the word robots to refer to traffic lights anymore, but everyone in South Africa will, if you say the word robots, they will know you mean traffic lights.、Hmm. I don't know why. We say robots. I don't know why. It's just what we do. But I think that word robots to refer to traffic lights is on its way out because I don't hear young people、mm-hmm. use it so much anymore. It's usually older people. I say traffic lights and my friends say traffic lights. But、mm. you can hear a lot of times when you are riding the Uber.、Mm. Uber、mm. driver always say to, Oh, where is、yeah. that? Okay, please stop that front of the robot. Yes, yes, yeah. Yes. So it is a very common thing. So、mm. when you are in South Africa and people say, Oh, I'll meet you at the robots in Long Street、mm. or something, they mean traffic lights.、Mm. Not like. The number one is robots. Robots, yes. Okay. 2つ目の南アフリカスラングに行きたいと思います。第2つ目は、アウェイ<笑>何でしょう<笑>アウェイ is a greeting. So you can say to your friend, like, アウェイアウェイ And it's usually you respond with, アウェイ So, アウェイ Okay, so I can say アウェイ You can、so、say アウェイ Yes. This is my experience.、Um, I could be very wrong. There are, a, it's a very, South Africa is, Very big country with many different、um, types of people, so different cultures, different races, different backgrounds, and we all, and different languages,、mm-hmm. and we all use different types of slang words.、Mm-hmm. And I grew up as a white English speaking person,、mm-hmm. so this is my experience with、mm-hmm. Awe. Also, I remember in high school,、mm-hmm. which was a while ago,、um, people were also using aware as like cool, awesome,、oh. nice as well.、Hey. So if you, if you like, hey, I, I got a job, or hey, you know, I did well, you'd be like, aware. You know,、oh. Like, yeah,、mm. nice. But usually it's a greeting. It's like,、mm. say to your friends, or like, I'm gonna be like, aware, Tani. 
<laughs> you could always just be like, away, oh, yeah. Hey, oh, I have a question. If you say away for like as also as nice, as nice, yeah. Then you can add some words like away, blah blah blah, or only away. Well, no. Usually, it's in response. So, like, if you're telling me a story, mm-hmm. like you can go, oh wait, like oh wait. But that 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 I haven't heard in a long time. Mm. It's usually now just greetings. Mm. Okay. Yes. So most important for mm. our is mm. greeting for your friends. Mm. Do you have any hand gesture? Because my experience. Yes. My friends, my South African friends. Yes. Told me. When you say away, I need to do away. <laughs> I've never. Away. I've never been like away. No, away. I've never, never. Okay. Usually it can be like if you it's like away or something. Or like I, yeah. I don't know. Like even there's like a thing that we used to do like that in high school. It's like slide. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But I don't remember it, so I'm probably doing it wrong. But no, they, I have never seen a specific hand gesture mm-hmm. like that mm-hmm. for Awe. Mm-hmm. So I think he was just making fun of you, wanting <laughs> <laughs> you to look stupid. That's it. Number two. Number two. Hi, so let's go. Mitsume, let's Why do you do this? Oh, and not this. Uh, this is German 3. Okay, this is like. Except German 3. No, this is like whatever, but this, I'm just, I was just curious. Anyway, okay, continue. Yes. Okay. So, number 3 is. How's it? <laughs> it's right. Yes, it's just funny. <laughs> how's it? How's it? How's it? Um, your. But, yeah, I, I know that because it's English. How is it? Yes. But for me, as a South African, I have never known how to respond to how's it. <laughs> Ever. Oh. I have heard that the correct response to how's it is how's it. <laughs> but the thing is, I don't know if someone is asking me like, how, how, how is it? How's it going? Which is what I'm thinking it is. Mm-hmm. But it could be like, it's usually just a greeting. So when people say, how's it? It's just like, mm-hmm. how's it? It's a greeting. But I can say, I'm good. Yeah. That's the thing. Sometimes I've done that before and then people give me like a look like, I don't really... Oh, it. so yeah. I must say, if I if you no. say, how's it? I need to say, how's it? I don't know. No. How's, how's it? No, I Both don't. Both no, I don't know. That's the thing. I don't know. Uh, I really don't know. Can, if if there is a South African out there who knows the correct way to respond to how's it, of my 25 years of being here, when people say how's it to me, I just like. <laughs> <laughs> that so if, if someone knows the answer, please well, comment. I know it's a greeting. I know it's a greeting. But the correct response to how's it, mm. I've heard, is mm-hmm. how's it. Oh. But that to me, I feel like it would be like, how's it? How's it? How's it? How's it? How's it? How's it? <laughs> you know? <laughs> but yes, um, again, I don't use how's it. I think not really common among my friend group. I think it's more, I've heard older Afrikaans men use it, Afrikaans people use it more, mm. but it is a very popular way of greeting. Okay, so but how you ask your feet? Like, how is it? How is it? How are you? Maybe, like, how is it? How are you? Oh. I've heard that as well. Oh, you're gonna say, how is it? How are you? I've heard, how, like, my uncle. That's very stupid. <laughs> <laughs> No, how are you? no. You can only say how is it. Don't. You? My, I've heard my uncle. This is a very, it's also very Joburg, Gauteng area. Yeah, my cousin and my uncle, they are from Gauteng, from Joburg specifically, and they use how's it a lot. And they, they, they've done like how's it, how are you to me, which is I think maybe they're just saying that to me because they know I'm like. <laughs> Confused, <laughs> but I think that that the correct it's it's like a hey 
Hey there. What's up? Oh. Like, like, how do you respond to what's up? Because people are like, what's up, man? And then you're like, yeah, what's up? You know? It's, uh, I think, the same as that. Mm. So, this is the number three. Number three. Yotsume wa shame. Yes. Then. Shame is not what you think. It's probably when I think you hear shame, you think like, ah, dishonor, bad. Shame in South Africa would be like a form of sympathy and feeling sorry, but also for something cute. So if someone says to you, ah, oh, you know, I hurt my finger, you could say, ah, oh, shame. Like, I'm sorry for you. Mm. And if you see a really cute, like, dog or puppy, you can go like, Shame! <laughs> <laughs> it's, okay. Yes, it's very popular and it's, it's a lovely way. I think it's such a nice way to be like, Shame, like, I don't know, it's just like cute, sad, I don't know. Pity. No, not pity. Pity no. is, is more cute. negative. Pity. No, it's sympathy. It's like you feel sorry for the person. Mm -hmm. It's not pity. It's mm -hmm. like when you hurt your when if when you hurt when your friend hurts yourself, do you pity them? Pity is more I feel like negative okay. connotation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So like I'd say it's more like you feel sympathy. You mm -hmm. you feel bad for them. Mm -hmm. So but yeah, and then also like feeling. Like moe, really cute. <laughs> moe. Moe, moe, yeah. <laughs> so shame is that the word to express mm. feeling cute. Mm. Yeah. Number four. <laughs> Hi, this is a part one of South African slang. We have lots more slangs we yeah. have here. Yes. How is it? What do you think? I was very fun. It was to fun talk about you, yes. Mm. And so I also talk about that South African slang a lot of times. So it's very useful uh, if I stay here. And it's very useful word, yes. So I highly recommend to you to use that word if you stay here. Only stay in South Africa. <laughs> because if you say that word in America or well, Japan, Japan, hey. nobody <laughs> understands. <laughs> yeah, it was fun. Mm -hmm. I think it was fun explaining um, mm -hmm. as a South African. Mm -hmm. uh, because also, there's a lot of slang that I don't use, but I know and we know, like, of. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, obviously, again, um, I may not be a hundred percent because this is a slang from my point of view <laughs> and from what I know. Yeah. So if you, what anyone watching knows the correct definition or correct way of saying, then please feel free to correct me and educate me because mm. <laughs> I think it's fun and cool to know, you know, how different it is for different people. Um, but yes, thank you for having me as an actual speaker this time. <laughs> okay, um, yes, uh, if you like this kind of stuff and you want to know more about Japan, not Japan, I mean South Africa <laughs> from a Japanese perspective, yes. then subscribe to Tani in Africa. Yes, please. Yes. And if you like me and you want to see more of me, you can comment and say, we want more Robin. <laughs> okay, I will think about it. If you comment a lot, I will call you, okay? <laughs> That's right. Yes. If nobody commented, then I'm still showing up. So. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm still being here. Um, if you like this video, Please hit the like button and smash the subscribe it's button. It's usually um what? It's usually smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe and okay. hit the notification bell. Very cool. I want to do that. No. Smash the like button and don't forget to smash the uh, <laughs> 
smash the like button don't forget to subscribe and see you see you next video bye bye